Well, it's Wednesday, and on Wednesdays we wonder. And I bet you're wondering, Lewis, I got a piece of concrete here, and I really need to put a hole in it. I know I wonder about that all the time. So how the heck do you drill a hole through a piece of concrete? I'm going to show you exactly how we do it. And it's not what you're thinking. Most of you are probably thinking, just grab a drill, right? Drill, drill bit, you've all seen this, DeWalt 20 volt drill, simple. This tip, this drill bit with this tip will drill through wood and it'll also drill through metal. It will not drill through concrete. It'll make a small indention in it, but the concrete will dole this so quickly that it will immediately stop drilling. So we have to use something different. A hammer drill that takes a very specific drill bit. And if you notice this drill bit doesn't really look like a normal drill bit. This drill bit here has a point to it, and it's made to cut. It's actually made to cut material. This drill bit is not made to cut material. This drill bit is designed to impact concrete. So I'm going to take this. I'm actually going to take it out of the drill, just like this, and I'm going to beat it into this piece of concrete right here. All right? Concrete drill bit is basically like a chisel. So the way this can be cut up or drilled through or broken with a chisel, if I just come in the at the angle right here, I can break this piece off just like that. Concrete's extremely brittle, but it's extremely hard. So a normal drill bit will actually get cut up and destroyed trying to drill through this. This is an extremely hardened tip. And all it's doing is hitting the concrete little by little, it's rotating a little rotating a little, just like that. And if we did this long enough, you would see that we're starting to develop a little hole right there. That little hole eventually will turn into a hole all the way through it. Different size drill bits, same thing. So this hammer drill here acts literally just like a hammering action, and it also spins at the same time. I can select on here hammer only, okay? And we see it's just hammering. And I could do that here, and it kind of goes down into it, but it makes a giant mess. If I go to hammer and drill at the same time, it'll do exactly that, spin and hammer. So it's gonna go in and out as it's spinning, just the exact same way I was doing here. So now, piece of wood underneath of it, I can just drill right through this. Just like that. The reason that works is because this stuff is so brittle, so hard. If I tried to use this, and it's already a little bit dull, so I don't mind doing this, I'm going to destroy this bit right now. It just makes these little tiny indentions in the material. It's not actually drilling through it. So right here, the drill just kind of barely puts an indention, whereas when you impact this material, because it's so brittle, it breaks. And if you do it in a controlled manner where you're impacting and spinning at the same time, you'll get a hole all the way through your material, just like that. Well, guys, it's Wednesday. Wonder no more.